In this SOLIDWORKS tutorial, I will explain you how to use the replace face command in SOLIDWORKS. I have explained all the tools for surface modeling in very short tutorials in a playlist that I will provide the link in description. You can check that out. Select here top plane and click on sketch guys. And from here select this center rectangle and make a center rectangle at this origin. Now let's select this smart dimensioning tool and specify the dimension for this rectangle length is 45 millimeter and here the width is 32 millimeter and select here extruded boss base in the feature specify 20 millimeter as height and click ok just to better visualize i am assigning material now select this face and here option for the sketch and this is the option for the spline now make a sketch like this click here here and make here a sketch like this and find here a midpoint and click here and now let's define this spline from this point to the line 9 millimeter from this point to this vertical line this is 13 and from this point to this point here specify the distance as 9 millimeter from this point to the bottom vertical line 4 millimeter is fine and from this point to this bottom here assign the dimension as 4.5 millimeter and press escape button and hold shift key select these two points and make relation as vertical and now this line has spline has turned into black one this means that it is fully defined and you can find the surface tab from here guys in the surface tab here you need to select the extruded surface command and enable the direction to and just randomly do it because we only want to intersect this one and now it's time to use the replace face command so here is the replace face and in this window we need to select this face and here we need to sel select the spline face and we, when we check this and here we have to hide this one because there is no more use of that surface and by using uh, this replace face we can get this surface like this so if you find this video helpful guys then please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.